welcome back to another episode of Kids Cooking with Tea. Today, we are going to be making M&M Rice Krispie Treats. The M&Ms are optional, but I'm going to be doing that because go big or go home. Before we start, I'm going to say I don't have an assistant today. And also, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when new videos come out. So let's get started. The things you're going to need are Rice Krispies, of course, any kind that you like. You're going to need butter, a teaspoon, a cup, vanilla extract. You're going to need mini marshmallows, 10 ounces. You're going to need a bowl. It does not have to be microwave safe because I don't think we're going to get microwave anything. M&M's. They are optional though. I'm going to be using them. You need Pam spray. You need a 13 by 9 inch pan. And you're going to need parchment paper. And a saucepan. Ours is already on the stove heating up. So let's do it. Okay, you're going to need a bowl for this part. The Rice Krispies and your cup. So I'm going to take my bowl and I am going to pour six cups of Rice Krispies in it. One. And six. It's going to be a little messy, but let's Let's do the next thing. Now we're gonna push our really yummy Rice Krispies to the side, and now we're gonna go over to the saucepan. Ah! So we've turned our oven on to medium high, and now what we're gonna do is we are going to drop in our butter, and we're just gonna swoosh it around a little bit so the whole pan gets buttery and ooey gooey. started mixing my marshmallows and my rice krispies together you are going to need an adult to pour the marshmallows in so we already did that ahead of time Grab and now what we're going to do is we are going to get the m&ms optional again and we're just going to pour them all in there here we go now we're going to mix it all up again This is your hands. All right. This is get gonna in get messy. Ah. Okay, we're gonna fast forward this part because it's gonna take a okay, while. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a little bit of parchment paper and we're gonna put it over and we're gonna press it down with the parchment paper on it so it doesn't ruin it. And we're just gonna do that till it's flat. Also, if you want to make a bigger batch, you can use a bigger pan, but this is how much we're going to use. And so now what we're going to do is, let's, I'm pretty sure we're going to leave it at room temperature for 15 minutes, and then we are going to come back 
and we are going to eat them. As usual, my brother is here to take some. Here he comes. All right, you ready? Let's try it. Mmm, mmm, this is really good. I like the M&M part. Well, anyways, thanks for watching Kids Cooking with Sam and Julie. I got muscles.